Now to calculate SXY, what you've got to do is use the formula, which you should know, is the sum of XY, sigma XY, minus sigma X multiplied by sigma Y, all divided by N. And all we need to do is just put the values in that you see in the table here. So sigma XY, 28,750. So put that in, 28,750. Minus sigma X, 315. 315 multiplied by sigma y which is 620 and n the number of values that you've got here which is 8 so divide by 8 if you do that division sum so on your calculator you end up with what you've got to show 4337.5 all right so that's s of xy now we need to work out SXX and if you remember this formula basically all you've got to do is just substitute wherever you see a Y you just substitute another X in so what you've got here is Sigma XX or Sigma X squared and then you've got minus Sigma X and then this becomes another X so you've got another Sigma X so you've got Sigma X all squared and then that's divided by n. So fill it in with numbers. Sigma x squared, we've got up here 15225, 15225, minus sigma x 315, so you've got 315 all squared, divided again by n, which is 8. Do that on your calculator, and what you should get is 2821. 0.875. Okay, so there are your answers for SXY and SXX.